Hey everybody. Well, we knew this day was going to come. And look what's back. Our resident eyesore. It's literally the guy who lets his dogs shit anywhere and everywhere he wants and doesn't pick up after it. Then on top of that, he's letting them off leash, which is an illegal around this area. It has to be on leash. And then there's, and then there's, and then there's, and then there's, and then there's. There's so many things, including the drug addicts that are sitting there doing needles right there. I, hello, I watched it three times. Some girl, some guy sitting there, and not both all at the same time, but like there's one time a guy, one time a girl. He may not have seen it, but still, come on, I don't care. You got the homeless people hanging around your place that everybody in the district knows is homeless and drug addict and literally troublemaking and like the place around here security keeps coming up and saying hey you gotta fucking knock it off yada da. police yada city district and like the bylaws keep coming by and yet now he's back people like this literally don't talk to if you talk to them, you're inhibiting them and you're allowing them to think, I'm good enough to stay here. If you just ignore them and you leave them be and you, if you anything, say, hey, when you getting the fuck off the block? Whatever, like, don't inhibit them by allowing them to be around because they're going to cause issues where we're losing our space. The auto mall in North Van is now four hours everywhere. So it's gone. There's no more parking there. It's it's done. So yeah, it's it's a sad thing and it's because of people like him. They don't move, they have the dogs, they have, they have, they have. And like there's so many of them around in the areas. If we could get rid of them, we would be better off. I move at least every night. It may not be off the block, but at least I move. And like the people around here even say, hey, at least we see that you're trying and like we know you work around here, so we forgive. But you're not moving. You're making a mess. You're having dog shit everywhere and you're having drug addicts and bums that are whistling and hooting and hollering at people walking by. It's not good. So... RV life guys, these are the type of people that are destroying it for us all.